Hey guys, so today we're going to be going through every LEGO modular building that has ever came out. If I did miss any, please drop a comment and I will pin your comment so other people can see that. And also, please pause the video. It doesn't have to be right now. It can be after the video. But please read the... I encourage you to read the Bible verse at the beginning of this video. And it will only take a few seconds out of your day and it will help you grow closer to God. Let's get right into the video. Alright, starting off with number one, we got set 10182. It's like a hotel one. I think it's really cool. And I'm pretty sure it's pretty old. I uh, could be mistaken, but this one looks really cool. Um, I don't. It's still probably not my favorite. I'll tell you at the end what my favorite is. But this one overall is a really cool set. Tell me your thoughts in the comments below. All right, starting off on the next one, we got one o set one o one eight five. This is I believe called the Green Grocer, and this one is really cool. Uh, it's kind of boring, but I mean, it was back when Lego just started doing these. I feel like I think this one's also very old. I could be mistaken again. But this one's honestly really cool as well. Tell me, again, your thoughts on this one. And I feel like the newer ones are just a little bit more, just a little bit cooler. But of course, these were probably not made for younger, the younger audience. And they were probably made for the older audience. The next one is, I believe, pretty popular. As you can see, the shop sign. I, I, I really remember that when I was younger. And it is at 102.11, or I believe it's called the Grand Emporium. Or Imperium, I'm not, I'm not completely sure. But as you can see, it's about to come up. The billboard is, that's one of the most, I feel like it, a lot of people know about. I think I know more about that. I think I've seen that billboard more than I've actually seen the building. I feel like I'm not completely sure, but that's just how I remember this set. And yeah, this is also a really cool one. And let's get, move on to the next one. The next one, I don't really know what this is. It's like a clock tower building. I'm not completely sure. Uh, it is at 10224. It it is really cool, and honestly, this is the one. I, this is one of them that I would like. But of course, this is really old, and it's probably really expensive right now. And comment down below if you remember this set. Alright, so the next one is the Parisian restaurant. It is set 10243. This set is. I remember this set a lot more than I do a lot of the other ones. This one's really cool, and I remember seeing this on the shelves, I believe. And this one, I don't really know what to say about it, but I really like it, and it's very detailed, I would say. Like the little top part of it right there. Oh, with the white, I don't know what those are called, but by the windows. Um, I mean the top, very roof, not the, the middle windows, but th this is a really cool set overall. So for the next one, I think a lot of people know about it. It is the pet store slash, not really sure what it is, but... It is a pet store and it is set 10218. I really remember this because of the pet sign right there, as you can see. I don't really know what the, the maybe the thing next to it is the the apartment, maybe. Maybe it's an apartment, but I really remember the pet store, that little sign right there. And this is an overall really cool set. So the next one is the Brick Bank, it's set 10251. It is really cool. And you know you're cool when you get the expert little little thing on your box, like all the other modulars. You know you're cool when you get that. But basically, this this one's really cool. I've seen this one in person. I think one of my friends had it. But this one, really good detail. I really like the color scheme as well. I, it's a sand green. I, it's, I think it's okay. I think behind the bank, there's something else too. I don't know if you could tell. Comment down below what you think that is. But this is really cool as well. The next one is when we're getting into the newer newer set modulars, and this is set 10270, the bookshop or birch books. And as you can see, the minifigures started having faces. There were more detail. I really don't like that like blue blue apartment. I don't really like that on houses and apartments and buildings and stuff. I do though like the book book store right there. That is a really cool set. And tell me your thoughts on this one as well in the comments below. I also really like that tree by the way. So the next one, I'm sorry for the blurry picture, it is set 10255, the assembly square. This one's really cool because it comes with a lot of different buildings um, that are all connected. It's a little bit smaller buildings, but they are really cool. And I guess you could put this, I'm kind of confused because the left building kind of looks like a corner building. And then the other two look like they would attach somewhere else. I mean, I'm not really sure what you could do with this one. I guess you could put it on the corner as well as on the side of a building. Both would be cool. Come and tell me your thoughts on this set below as well. One more quick thing about this set. I really do like the roses in the, in the, on the middle store. And I also really like that 
Oh, I just saw this pretzel part. That one's really cool with the pretzel building sign. That's really cool. I also do like how many minifigures there are. And then the middle part with the fountain, that is also really cool. And this would look very good in a city. So if you are looking to pick up a different one, this one would be really cool. It may be really, it may be more expensive because I believe this is a little bit older. I could be wrong again. But comment down below again what you think about this set. All right, the next one is set 10260. This is probably one of my favorite modulars, if not my favorite, is the downtown diner. This one looks so cool. And when I first saw this, I was like, this is really cool. The car looks cool, minifigures are good. And just the, the old type look of it is just really cool. And I own this one, if I didn't say that doubt it in it. And I really like it. I like the letters. And if you are looking to pick one of these up, this is a very good one as well. And it is also, I think, one of the cheapest ones, I think. Could be wrong again. Comment down below what you think about this one. I think this is a lot of people's favorites. The next one is probably my second favorite. It's the Corner Garage. It is set 10264. This one's really cool. I like that little umbrella at the top. That's really cool. And I saw a review, or I think it was a review on this. And the floors are really cool, I think. They're a little small, which is a, it's, it's okay. Because it is a Lego set. And it really is the outside that makes, that's the best part. And then the truck, the old little truck, that's also really cool. And the minifigures, I think, are also good as well. I like the little, the trees as well this next one actually hasn't been released yet i got this fit in these pictures from ashley Plaster's video and this building looks really good i'm kind of confused on the side two parts of it like the purple and green I'm not really sure what that is the minifigures look pretty cool but it's really the building that really looks really good i the it's something i don't know i think it's the side parts where it has the little dark tan that looks really cool it makes it look mm, kind of police building type vibe i feel like there i really like the little little minifigure guy that has the donut hanging like he's fishing for police officers or like he's trying to get them away so he can go get the cash or whatever he wants all right that's going to be it for this video hope you guys enjoyed and thanks for watching i want to encourage you again to please read the bible verse in this video please also check out my other videos and my other channels if you like gaming or skits i have those on, uh, on two other channels so please check those out k-o-o-l-k-e-a is my gaming channel and and k-e-a films is my uh, uh channel for skits thank you guys please drop a like and drop a sub and remember god loves you and i do too